the Nigerian army has ordered the closure of the Amnesty International offices in Nigeria, alleging that the organization is working to destabilize the country. The army claimed that Amnesty falsified fictitious stories of human rights abuses against Nigerian security forces, while alleging that Amnesty was involved in covert sponsorship of dissident groups to protest. These accusations come three days after the army accused UNICEF of aiding terrorism in the Northeast. It was not the military that uh, you know, um, established Amnesty International Office in Nigeria. So what you did not uh, set, you know, or what did not establish, you know, how will you now say you don't want it to happen? Secondly, you know, we just want to, you know, call on the security agencies, including the military, that rather than these threats, they should look at, you know, the problems, you know, of human rights abuses in Nigeria. Amnesty International reported that over 3,600 people died in the past three years in clashes between farmers and herders, with 57% of those deaths occurring in 2018. It is not the first time there has been a fallout between the Nigerian army and Amnesty International over human rights reports in the country. Roots TV Nigeria.